How are you? I'm the man, Simo Mao. Do you know me? Ibo Evangelist Tuki Buka Anosiobi. Ina kana ika na sombe kes. Ina kana ika na sombe kes. Swani ibu na. Ole a hangin. What where the are to? Ole state is it? Akuma, Noro East, local government area, and Kedina Imo State in Nigeria. Mama ngi boy e be. Oye Belgium. Belgium. E be ka murongi. Na Belgium. Hey. And na be. Hey. And na be. Praise God. You see it. Don't worry, I'm go I, I will take you. Yeah? Yeah? Actually, me go send them. Kiki ma on your hobo. Oh yeah. Oh no. Oh yeah, the hand. Chukune ni ama siat. Oh my man, you come back on one. Bye. Okay, ma, 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 where let it? Lele na, lele na, ina gele. Where is the father? So their mother is from Belgium. So how do you make these children? Because of most people never, most of Igbo people never that are born in America, UK, their children don't know how to speak their mother tongue. Look at this one. They have Belgian mother born in Belgium speaking Igbo fluently. They are not ever with you, Hano. You know, uh -huh. you see, this, these are what I'm preaching. Since yesterday, since yesterday, he has been shouting, I am Igbo, I'm, I'm hearing. And that is why I gave him opportunity. Most of you, your children don't know how to speak your tongue. Igbo, you hear it, hear Listen, it's a shameful thing. It's a shameful thing. I'm not even talking about America and UK. There are some that their children are born in Onisha. Onisha. Or where? They don't know how to speak the language. Let me tell you. We must get rid of Western colonialism. Anybody that his children don't know how to speak the mother tongue, you are still a slave to the Western people. Because what your identity is your language that is whom you are it's only Igbo people that are making such nonsense you see the children now there is no how tomorrow i'm on high age they will definitely come back but all these children you born in uk america they don't speak your language they don't even come home if you die the highest respect they will give you is the common leader of Iberia over you have a lost generation many Igbo people will have lost generation Yorubas are many in London Yorubas are many in UK but they all speak Yoruba you will go to a bank where an Igbo person is walking you see her get kid even when she goes to know you are Igbo is when she will begin to speak vocabulary Who do this for us? No go better for us. And if you see us, it's only in Nigeria that people can be disqualified of getting a good job because they don't know how to speak good English. If you go to Germany, nobody cares about English. If you go to it Italy, if you don't know how to speak Italian, nobody cares. It's only here the they judge someone who is intelligent because the person can speak good English. 
If you go to, work, to look for work in our bank, if you don't know how to speak grammar, they can't give you work. In our own country, we value English more than our own language. Look at these two boys. I don't know you. Because of what you have done, I will see you one-on-one -on -one before you go back to Belgium. Now, look at it. Do, can you imagine? They are, they are not even born with, by Nigeria, by Igbo. Born over there in Belgium, speaking Igbo very well. And your own children, you are giving excuses, and they are messed up. Especially these are our people in America and Europe. <laughs> Amen. You know, I bless God. Since yesterday, the boy has been getting attention for me to speak to him. He's proud. I don't know why we should forget. Listen, it's not everything we must emulate from the Western people. I emulate what is good they are doing. But things that are not good, we cannot emulate it. It is the duty of the parents. Any child born and abroad that don't know how to speak their language is the parental fault. Keep tell, speak, nyama, nyama. Uh, so that they will even when some of you will see some of some parents so ashamed so annoying even if you speak Igbo to their children they will tell you and uh, he doesn't understand the Igbo as if to say if he or she does not understand no jebel anyway i told me where's the anointing in the butter now okay oh oh naturally like you were today now god bless you i love you i love you i love you i love you I will see two of you and your dad before the end of the program. After the program.